Hey guys, have you ever had sex so good that all you can do is say one word things? Dick, fuck, cunt, pussy, cock. Bedpost? TV? Neighbor? Mom? Must be some good sex. I shared my dream with you until the morning. Everybody else had done it right. A few days ago, I was hanging out with a friend. I saw a white guy that looked like Jesus, so I said, hey, check out white Jesus over there. And my friend went, why Jesus gotta be white? And I'm like, well, if it was a black guy that looked like Jesus, I'd say he looked like black Jesus. If it was an Asian guy, I'd say he looked like Asian Jesus. If he Mexican, he just looks like Jesus. And that's when my friend said, you're retarded, Ryan. And I said, where's my helmet? So hey guys, I am Ryan Necro. And I know this video is going to be a little weird, but so many people complain that I do so many professional videos, or I make them look professional. Shit. What you don't see is I'm sitting in a basement. There's a pile of clothes right there. There's a washer right there. There's a bar over there I used to record in. There's a dryer over there. And there's fucking cobwebs hanging from the ceiling. This is as professional as it gets. But just to prove everyone wrong and show them that I do have a non-professional side, which I don't understand how my videos are professional. They just look good. Fuck off. I thought I would do what I'm calling a unprofessional video. So I took notes from what everyone said. And this is the video you get. Is this unprofessional? Is this unprofessional? I was a mean Miley Cyrus. So about five years ago, I used to be addicted to heroin. Now, I'm not giving you no boohoo story, because, I mean, who gives a fuck about a boohoo story today? I want to give you the story that I don't tell that many people, and that is how crazy that bitch was I lived with. And if you're watching this later down the road, I don't give a fuck what you think about me. So this lady, I used to live with her, her husband, and a friend of mine. And we would go to the big city every day and get some heroin. What most people don't know is that on the way to the city, she had to send up a prayer to Jesus. Sweet baby Jesus. That we did not get pulled over. Crazier part, before she snorted her heroin, we all had to say grace. Oh, Heavenly Father, thank you for this dust we're about to snort up our goddamn nose. In your name, amen. Crazy times, doing heroin with Jesus Lady. So, I was in Louisville, Kentucky once, and I ran into a homeless guy in the alleyway. We ended up getting to chit-chatting, and he told me that he had a starring role that he could get if only he could grow his dick about four more inches. So, I told him I could help him with that, and we proceeded to tie our dicks together and play stretchy tug-of-war. Little did I know that he was a she. And that dick was fake. It was paper mache. I didn't know this until I looked down and the blood was squirting out my dick hole and I could see her running down the block, my dick in hand. And to this day, I still wear that paper mache dick. And to this day, I have to turn off the TV when Jennifer Lawrence appears because it just brings back nightmares. And that's kind of why I don't like penis enlargement pills. The first time I was 16, and it was a 12 year old who thought I was over 18 and wanted me to purchase him an R rated video game. My first thought was, take the money and go. My mom's story was about alcohol, and she looked at them when they asked and just said, How old are you? Oh, well, we're 19, and not old enough. And she grabbed her beer, cackled like a witch, and walked the fuck away. So, hey guys, I know this video is a little weird, it was a little unprofessional. Uh, fuck you. Is that unprofessional enough? <laughs> so, I hope you enjoyed it. If you actually liked the unprofessional video and the style that I did it in, let me know down in the comments. I am Ryan Necra, and I'll feel you later.